Hello my dear children, welcome to EVS class. In today's EVS class, we will continue with the chapter Keeping Safe and learn about some safety rules at school, at playground and at home. Children, always remember to follow safety rules wherever you go to avoid injuries and accidents. Now let's learn some safety rules at school. School is a place where we learn how to read, write, play, share, make new friends and have a lot of fun. But in school, many accidents happen when you are in hurry. So children, there are certain rules that you must follow at school to stay safe and avoid accidents. The rules that keeps us safe at school are to not push others while going up or down the stairs. Do not stand or jump on a desk, you may fall and get hurt. Do not run around in a classroom. Walk in a line inside a school building. Do not run and push each other in the corridor or while walking in a line. Do not hit others or fight with your friends. Inform the class teacher about any injuries, fights or mishaps. Wait for your turn everywhere. Do not enter lab such as science lab or computer lab without your teacher. Place your bags and water bottles neatly as someone can trip and fall if you don't keep it properly. If you get hurt while playing, inform your teacher. Your teacher will take care of you. Do not rush to get into the school bus. Always wait for your turn. Be obedient and always listen to your teachers. They care for you and your safety. So children, always follow your class and school rules to stay safe. Safety rules at playground Children, we should be very careful while playing at the playground. The safety rules that we should follow at the playground are do not jump off from moving swing and also do not stand too close to a moving swing. You may get hurt. Play in a park or a ground where other adults are also present. Do not push or hit each other while playing. Don't stand at the end of the slide. Someone may hit you while sliding down. Never play near thorny pushes or popped wire. Every game has its rules, so we must follow them. Make friends and enjoy with them while playing safe. Safety rules at home. Do not throw your toys here and there. Always arrange your scattered toys in a toy box after playing. Do not touch open sockets, plugs, electric wires and switches with wet hands. Do not play with matchsticks and fire. Do not scatter your shoes here and there on the floor. Someone may trip over them, so children always keep it in the proper place. Do not touch hot things like iron, oven or heaters. They can give you electric shock. Use objects like knife, blade, scissors under the supervision of an adult. Never use these objects when you are alone. Do not spill water on the floor. Immediately wipe it off before someone slip on it and get hurt. Never go too close near fire. It may burn your skin. Do not distract your mother or any other person while they are cooking. When someone knocks the door, always see the visitor through the door hole before you open the door. It can be a stranger or it can be a danger. A stranger is a person whom you have not seen or know anything about them. Children, when you are alone at home, never open the door for a stranger. 
refuse to eat anything given by a stranger do not share your secrets and family details with a stranger in this way you invite the danger always keep a first aid box at home for emergency children first aid means the immediate help given to an injured person we use it for minor injuries such as cut burn bleed or other wounds children i hope that these safety rules were informative for you all stay safe and in case of any accident never panic stay calm and look for help always remember that your life is precious and you should take care of yourself okay now children let's do some exercise questions from the textbook now all of you turn to page number 82 Tick the correct options. Number one, you should cross the road. Option A, anywhere on the road. Option B, only at the zebra crossing. Which is the correct option? Yes. Option B, only at the zebra crossing. Number two, amber light means option A, stop. Option B, wait. Option C go Children amber is a yellow color in traffic lights what does amber light indicates it means wait option B wait Number 3 you should not play with dash option A fire option B sharp objects option C plastic bag option D all of these Children you should not play with all of these right these are all dangerous so option D all of these number 4 you should go to a swimming pool dash option A with a coach option B all alone which is the correct option yes option A with a coach next Answer the following Why do we need to follow safety rules Answer We need to follow safety rules to keep us safe from accidents and injuries Once again We need to follow safety rules to keep us safe from accidents and injuries Children that's all for today go through and learn the exercise questions that we have done we will continue again with the exercise questions in the next EVS class thank you children have a nice day